All right, so this is a quick video on how to edit these to make sure when you click them, they're open the right thing. So, all you need to do is open up your documents. You want to jump into documents, go down to rain meter, skins, and in here you'll find honeycomb. These are the honeycombs, obviously. So what you need to do to change the links is right go into them, right click on the INI file, edit with Notepad++ or normal Notepad. Jump in here. On this left mouse up action, you're going to edit this to the application you want to open. This is a Chrome icon, I want to start open Chrome. So all you need to do to find that is go into here, search for Chrome, right click on it, and quick way to do this, which will always work, is to create a shortcut. Then you're going to grab it from your desktop. You're going to right click on it. You go to go properties. And here it is, ready to go, even with the uh, everything you need. So you're going to go here and you're going to paste it on. Obviously, it's the same thing, so it's not going to do anything. That's it. All you need to do, you're done. That edits all of them. So if you want to do that with, say, Premiere, it's the same process. It's right there. That's the program. If you want to make your own one of these skins, all you got to do is change this picture to reflect the program you want to open. Then in here, all you have to do is change where it opens. It's easy. And then you change these names to make sure it's opening the right image, so it shows up on your desktop. That's all you need to know. I hope this helps. Good luck opening your programs with honeycombs.